Alright you guys, so, <sighs> excuse the mess in the background, or whatever, anyways, this is actually as clean as my area really gets. <laughs> but, she picks up my stuff and I get so upset because then I can't find anything, I'm missing brushes, like she oh, picked up and I haven't found a, two brushes since. Anyways. Because your area drives me crazy. Well, great. Just pay attention to your area. Mind your own business. <laughs> That's what I say. So, I'm working on the wheel that's for myself. Um, as well as I'm making an ethnic robin to sell. I'm working on the Aurora Sky Baby for the giveaway baby. I'm working on that giant toddler. Um, and I'm finishing up a custom set of twins a and b and then jackie's gonna do painted hair on them but this will has a gray undertone his kit so i'm working with a pink white mix kind of thing before i get started into doing my flesh work because i don't want my flesh work to turn him even more gray and that's what will happen He'll be ugly and gross and disgusting. So, anywho. So, I'm working with this base. And then, I'm going to start in with my flesh work. Like you guys know, I really don't neutralize. Well, I do neutralize, but um, it's all part of my flesh. My flesh is my neutralizing. But it's a very special mix. And, no, I actually won't tell you guys how to make it. But you will see it, and it may deceive you guys, because it'll look like almost white, but it's not white. There's actually like three or four things that are mixed into it to get the color. So, yeah, you guys are more than welcome to experiment with it. But this wheel is so cute. Um, I love, his hands are one of my favorite things, besides his expression. And if I get him... Oh, ah, you just kicked my oh, thing, man. Sorry. Always wrecking everything. Should call you wreck it, Ralph. Are you on a mission or something? <laughs> because you're just being Just trying to feisty. keep it fun around here. So anyways, back to our doll. My idea for this doll is to look very much like Emma. Well, it looks so cute, babe. With Emma's coloring. No. <laughs> I want that very newborn look, um, like Emma and, well, and like the twins have. I love that look. I do not, for my dolls, I don't like my dolls to be pretty babies. You want them to be ugly babies? No, I just want, I just like the realism of like what young newborns look like. It's probably why I don't really have older dolls in my collection. I like the young newborn look. I do still plan to get a toddler one day. It's just I bought the kit and I was like, oh god, this kit is so ugly. And then every version I've seen of the kit made is freaking ugly, man. So it really was discouraging because I was already like, ah, this kit is horrible. What am I going to do with it? And then I've seen like hella people make it. I was like, ah, nobody can even make it look somewhat cute. So yeah, so got rid of that kit. Just have to get another one. So this one has a belly plate. I wasn't going to paint it, but then I was like, well, if I ever resell him, because you guys know that that happens. Stuff don't stay around here long. Um, people like to have a belly plate, so I personally don't use them much. But it is what it is. So I'm going to do two layers of this um, pinky neutralizing mix to get a good undertone. Like a, looking for like a rosy undertone. And then I'm going to go in with my skin. And this, this kit came with. Look at that like neon pink spot. It looks like a pink highlighter. And of course the person that sold it to me was like, 
Oh, I never even looked at the kit. And it's like, seriously, if you're going to sell freaking kits, especially if I'm paying a lot for it, you really need to check these out. So I'm pretty sure that person knew that there was a spot on it. Just didn't say anything so they could try to play the I didn't know card. Because, I mean, I get all my kits and I look at them and before I sell them, I look at them again. It's just being irresponsible. It's not cool, though. But with time and layers, it should... Whoop, blurry. It should cover over, so that's what I'm hoping for. Ah, oh, those dogs. Jackie's mom's dogs bark like nuts, man. And they're irritating, like they don't stop. Oh, gosh. Can't wait to be in Texas. Oh, it's gonna be so nice. So nice. And I'm gonna have my own nursery over there. I'm already, I bought the, um, bedding for it so once we get there I'll get a crib and it's just gonna be a room devoted to the nursery which is cool I've never had just a room devoted to the reborn nursery so that'll be a lot of fun but yeah all right so I had to pause that because Jackie was <sighs> yelling at our dogs because they had they always want to go over there and pester her mom's dog so yeah just was too much chaos going on so doing two layers of that mix that I told you guys about this is basically what I do to work with kits that have that gray undertone I start with a pink white looking mix to give it you know a little bit of a rose color that way when I start working with my neutralizing skin mix it doesn't turn more gray so yeah so um thank you for watching